China is pushing the boundaries of space technology once again with the Connecticut 2 rocket, a cutting-edge development by the Chinese Academy of Sciences CAS Space. This advanced liquid propellant rocket, designed for large-scale satellite constellations, recently hit a major milestone with a successful stage separation test. This isn't just another test, it's a pivotal step toward the rocket's highly anticipated maiden flight in 2025. In this video, we'll delve into what makes the Connecticut 2 so revolutionary, explore the significance of this recent achievement, and uncover how this rocket is set to reshape China's future in space exploration. If you're curious about the next big leap in space technology, you won't want to miss this. The Connecticut 2 rocket is not just another piece of hardware, it's a marvel of modern engineering that showcases China's commitment to advancing its space capabilities. Designed with standardization, serialization, and modularization in mind, the Connecticut 2 is built to meet the demands of large-scale satellite constellations and low-cost cargo transportation. What sets this rocket apart is its common booster core CBC configuration. The rocket features a core stage diameter of 3.35 meters and a total length of 53 meters making it one of the most formidable medium-sized rockets in its class. The Connecticut 2 packs a punch with a liftoff weight of 625 tons and a liftoff thrust of 766 tons. These specifications make it capable of delivering payloads of up to 8 tons to Sun Synchronous Orbit SSO and 12 tons to Low Earth Orbit LEO. This level of capability is crucial for China's plans to deploy and maintain large satellite constellations like the Qianfan G60 Mega Constellation Project. The rocket's design ensures that it can launch into various orbits, including sun-synchronous, low-Earth, and transfer orbits, making it a versatile tool for a wide range of missions. The Connecticut 2's engineering also emphasizes cost-effectiveness, a key factor in enabling more frequent and diverse space missions. By focusing on modularization, CAS Space has created a rocket that can be easily adapted for different missions, reducing the time and cost associated with launch preparations. This adaptability is not just a technical achievement, it's a strategic advantage that positions China as a leader in the commercial space race. As we'll see in the next section, the recent stage separation test is a testament to the rocket's robust design and engineering excellence. The recent successful stage separation test marks a critical milestone in the development of the Connecticut 2 rocket. This test was not just a routine procedure, it was a comprehensive assessment of the rocket's readiness for space. The test validated the functioning of all systems involved in the separation of the rocket's first and second stages, a process that is crucial for the rocket's performance during flight. In simpler terms, this test was like a dress rehearsal for the rocket ensuring that every component works seamlessly when it counts. The stage separation is one of the most complex and delicate maneuvers in rocket science. It involves precise coordination of multiple systems, including unlocking devices, energy separation mechanisms, gas line disconnections, cable disconnections, and shock absorption systems. The fact that the Connecticut 2 passed this test with flying colors speaks volumes about its engineering reliability. But why is this test so important? The success of the stage separation test not only confirms the rocket's technical readiness, but also sets the stage for its maiden flight in 2025. This achievement is a major step forward in the timeline of the Connecticut 2 project, bringing it closer to becoming operational. The test also highlights the effectiveness of CAS Space's secondary unlocking scheme for stage separation, which was a key focus of the test. This scheme ensures that the separation process is not only successful but also safe and efficient, reducing the risk of failure during actual missions. The ability to reliably separate stages is vital for the rocket to complete its mission and deliver its payload to the intended orbit. With this test behind them, the engineers at CAS Space can now focus on fine-tuning other aspects of the rocket's design, ensuring that the Connecticut 2 is fully prepared for its maiden voyage. In addition to validating the separation mechanisms, this test also provided valuable data on the rocket's overall performance, which will be crucial for further development. Every detail from the unlocking devices to the energy distribution during separation was carefully monitored, giving engineers deeper insights into the rocket's behavior under stress. 
This meticulous attention to detail is what sets the Connecticut II apart and ensures that it will be ready to meet the ambitious goals set for its future missions. The Connecticut II rocket isn't just about breaking technological barriers, it's a strategic asset that will play a pivotal role in China's future space endeavors. One of its most significant applications is its potential to support large-scale satellite constellations, such as the Qiangfan G60 Mega Constellation Project. This project, along with others like the second-generation carbon emission monitoring satellite, positions China to expand its capabilities in space-based communications, Earth observation, and environmental monitoring. The Connecticut II's ability to deliver payloads to various orbits means that it can be used for a wide range of missions, from deploying commercial satellites to launching scientific instruments. This versatility is crucial as China seeks to solidify its position as a global leader in space technology. Moreover, the Connecticut II is designed with cost-effectiveness in mind, making it a game-changer for commercial space operations. By reducing launch costs, this rocket opens up new opportunities for smaller companies and startups to enter the space industry. This democratization of space access could lead to a surge in innovation, with new players contributing to the growth of satellite-based services and technologies. The Connecticut II is not just a tool for national projects, it's a platform that can be leveraged by a wide range of stakeholders, both within China and internationally. The rocket's development also aligns with China's broader strategy to enhance its space capabilities and reduce reliance on foreign technology. By mastering key technologies like stage separation and modular design, China is building a robust foundation for future space exploration, including potential missions to the moon and beyond. As we look ahead, the Connecticut II's success will likely inspire further advancements in rocket technology, driving China's space program to new heights. The rocket's maiden flight in 2025 will be a significant moment, not just for China but for the global space community. It will demonstrate the country's growing prowess in space exploration and its commitment to pushing the boundaries of what's possible. The Connecticut II rocket is more than just a technological achievement, it's a symbol of China's ambition to lead in the next frontier of space exploration. With its successful stage separation test and innovative design, this rocket is poised to play a key role in the deployment of satellite constellations, scientific missions, and commercial space ventures. As we've discussed, the Connecticut II represents a significant step forward in China's space capabilities, combining engineering excellence with strategic foresight. Its development is not just about advancing technology, but also about creating new opportunities for collaboration, innovation, and exploration. The rocket's upcoming maiden flight in 2025 will be a momentous occasion, marking the beginning of a new era in China's space program. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. See you next time.